Well, hello, beautiful friends and soul family, beautiful rising, good afternoon, and or lovely evening to you wherever you are, depending on the location of your rotation. Mm -hmm. Thank you for stopping by my channel. This is our Daily Chakra Energy Reading, and today is Saturday, September 23rd of 2023 so happy saturday to all of you out there today is also the fall equinox so today is a day where the sun is shining on the equator and we have equal amounts of day and night and this happens twice a year once in the springtime and once in the autumn so, yeah, we are, so we are stepping, dipping into the second, I'll say, like, the second half of the year, even though, like, I know it's the end of the year, kind of, like, if you're counting, like, the, <laughs> like, the Gregorian calendar, but technically, this is the middle of the year, if the beginning of the year was in spring, as it normally is. So, yeah. Yeah, we're halfway through the, I'll say, like, the season year. Anyways, yeah. So, that's exciting. I already have been outside, and it is feeling just like a little bit cooler the air is a little bit fresher it's like that crisp yeah like that crisp early ah, breeze and like it's kind of cool and ah I love it I just love it I love all the seasons for just the different things that they offer <laughs> you know so, like, I just have to, just have to appreciate it sometimes because it's not like we can change the seasons. And so, they've been happening since Earth has been a thing. So, the odds of me being able to change them are quite slim. So, yeah, I simply accept and love them. So, yeah. So all of my readings are intended to be timeless, meaning whenever you have found this video is when you are meant to hear the message. So if your guides have led you here, your spirit, your ancestors, your higher self, the divine, or even if someone has shared this video with you and you decided to watch it, then there is a message here for you. So use your intuition to tune into what that message is for you. So, yeah, happy Saturday. Today we have a throat chakra affirmation, fifth chakra energy. Look at that healing symbol. Card number 61. I consciously experience my creative powers as the source of fulfillment and purpose in my existence. I consciously experience my creative powers as the source of fulfillment and purpose in my existence. Yeah, so I love that. I love that it says I consciously experience my creative powers because when we are actually present in the creativity and our creativeness or, you know, when we are actually present in that, it, I feel that it is even more fulfilling for us. Um, so yeah, let's read what the book has to say for the meaning. I consciously experience my creative powers as the source of fulfillment and purpose in my existence. Meaning, work in the sense of the creative force, be creative invent, try things out, and learn. Find new solutions and variations of old paths. 
This is how you can experience yourself and fill your life with meaning. You have talents that no one else has. Don't waste them by letting them degenerate through, I think this is meant to say, through lack of use. Be conscious of what you create and try to comprehend that you and God have something important in common, the creative force. The more you include this in your life, the more you will feel your life to be meaningful. Healing Stone, Topaz, and Jadeite. The fragrance essence is pine, and the box flower is white chestnut. So, yeah, we are being guided to truly step into our life experience. Be creative. Invent. Try things out. Learn. Find new solutions and variations to old paths. All of these things, if we are consciously stepping into them and consciously, you know, trying new things and believing in ourselves, then that leads us to be in, like, I feel a constant state of just happiness and bliss. Like, just to know that we are going through this consciously, we are learning things consciously, we are inventing things consciously. I feel that when we are doing everything from a conscious mindset and enjoying it, just enjoying the things that we're doing and knowing that, yeah, each of us has talents that no one else has and we are using those talents consciously, it can lead us to just so much fulfillment and make life so much more meaningful to all of us. So what is it that you can do? What is it that you have that no one else has? Like, even if you feel music, like, if music is your thing, what is it that you are different like, you're always going to bring your own essence to whatever it is that you do. So, if music is something you love, then do that. And do that in your own beautiful way, however that is. If you love painting, do that. <laughs> Just do it in your own beautiful way. Know that you are the only one that can put your own experience and beauty on something that you create. So I feel that we're being guided to just step into that and f fully embody that within our conscious life and to be present in that. So whatever that means for you, however that means for you, maybe it's writing stories, maybe it's writing poetry, maybe it's you know, making videos, however it applies to you, you know, this is, this is your sign to start doing that, to lean into it and do it to, to fit you because you're the only one that can do it the way that you would do it. So thank you so much for being here. I truly do appreciate all of you who watch these videos each and every day. You guys are amazing so ah, yeah I hope you all have a beautiful Saturday thank you so very much for being here I love you I appreciate you and I will see you in the next one